I'm Tommy Hutchinson, you know, I'm founder of an organization called iGenius, which is a world community of social entrepreneurs. We're actually running a European Union project um, with the ISAT and with the OECD and an organization called Lenaria. So we, uh, CAPS was good for us because we held a seminar um, here at this event and it was a, an audience that was interested in the subject that we're looking at, which is the use of statistics and data for the social economy. And uh, so, so it, it was a natural place for us to do an event, um, particularly as we were focusing on looking at areas of policy recommendation for the European Union or for individual countries, etc. So it was, it's been a really good ideal audience for us. Many of the subjects that CAPS is looking at are quite deep subjects that are undergoing a lot of change. And so I think to be able to take some time out from our day job and look at the future and try and almost predict what that might look like, I think that's really, really useful. Increasingly difficult to get out of the day job because everybody is under all kinds of pressure, time, money, many other things. Um, but I think we all need some time to, to sit back, to talk to other people from different experiences and uh, to see what situation they're in. And one of the things I found really useful about here is uh, it caps is the potential to, to find people whom you would want to work with. And I think that's the real gem of Europe is that we have that kind of open mind of people wanting to work with each other. I think there are big challenges and there are small challenges. So the big challenges for Europe is so, so many people have no job. Uh, there's inequality, which really affects the economies and so on. Uh, just look at some of the issues that are contemporary today from what's happening in Greece and countries like that. And I think that Europe has got all kinds of issues that are, you know, Europe is a place that ever, a lot of people want to go to, and that in itself is causing issues. So I think that we need to be a very open, inclusive economy and find ways that we can try and work together to solve these problems, because we won't solve them on our own. Uh, on a smaller level, we all have our individual problems with our business or organization, but, but there is a greater, greater important good out there that we have to work towards. In a world which is changing so fast, there are so many opportunities, both in Europe and beyond Europe. Um, and I think actually, whilst Europe is, we're learning to explore, and we're doing it quite well, where we're working together, I think we also have to connect Europe to the outer world, to the emerging economies that are going on in Asia, South America, Africa, and so on. So I think that those are where the real opportunities, and I think Europe has got a number of strengths, that one, we are relatively intelligent people with a good education system and so on. We're used to working with people from different cultures, and I think that gives uh, Europe quite an advantage in engaging with the rest of the world.